Detroit, bro. We out to the club after this. Yeah. You know that, man. Do you like it better than Toronto though? I see you're doing a lot of Canadian things. You're going to hockey games, ice skating, wearing your Toronto toque. What's, what's this all about? Ah, uh, you know, I love Toronto. Like I said, you know, when we went to Toronto, I got to watch a basketball game. I needed a basketball team and uh, they was the one. And I did. They're doing good this year. So I, I love it. You know, I love it. I love the... I love the gear, I love the support. A lot of Canadians came down, you know, they're hitting me up on Twitter saying, I'm coming down from Toronto, I'm coming down from Winnipeg, I'm coming down from here, you know? across the border. Yeah, so, like, a lot of them is, uh, a lot of them showing me love, so, it's cool. Uh, when Frankie Edgar got inj injured, uh, did you feel that Aldo was going to be the replacement uh, once they, they told you? Look, like, <laughs> yeah, that's what I like to hear. You know, at, at the end of what I, uh, what I told you guys, I got 250 cupcakes coming in, you know? Who, who the hell... Who, who doesn't like the new flavor, you know? I wanted to eat a new flavor, but hey, there's the other ones, the same ones, I'll eat them again. I don't care, you know, these guys like cupcakes to me, you know, they're all on the menu. And speaking of food, you've been working with Tyler Mitten ahead of this fight. How's yep. the cut going? You seem uh, really healthy, really in a great mood. I tell you that much, I tell you this much, uh, I'm the same around, uh, I'm the I'm the same size I was around last time, and, uh, and I have way more energy last the last fight and stuff when we was getting down and we getting close you know i was doing a lot of things wrong i found out yeah. and uh tyler came and fixed it you know you see my energy you see me talking you see how vivid i am how lively i'm always lively but this is a little extra and uh tyler's the man man you know i um last year around this time i was in detroit i was in toronto i didn't have a thanksgiving you know this time i ate four times during thanksgiving so uh tyler's the man how, how did that get set up with you working with him uh you know i just I, 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 Lockhart, Lockhart kept reaching out to my manager saying uh, they want to work and I was nice, Lockhart is always a cool dude and I always wanted to work with him, you know, and uh, times came, you know, Tyler came, uh, then Tyler's name came up because Lockhart was out and uh, because that's one of uh, Lockhart's guys, of course, DC called me up and, uh, you know, the rest is history, we're here now and I'm eating, I'm eating good, guys. You see my post? Follow me on Instagram. You see all that? You and see it looks, all that food? It looks delicious, too. Yeah. Oh, the Great food is delicious. The food is, yeah, I did see a story. Thank you for shouting them out. And the, the food is delicious, you know. And not only, not only regular food, he's, this guy is making me snacks, you know. Like, I love peanut butter and jelly and all that good stuff. And he's doing all that kind of stuff for me. So, you know, I love rice. This guy's been feeding me rice. He been, he been giving me some, uh, lamb chops. Go look at my, go look at my, go look at my Instagram. I got lamb chops, brother. Lamb chops. I'm about, I'm about that lamb chop life, bro. You tell me what the lamb chops is, I'll go. Max, it seems a lot of people are saying, I mean, even all of stem cells, he had a leg injury apparently in the yeah. first fight. He couldn't leg kick. Yeah. If he comes out and is throwing a lot more leg kicks, landing them, how's that changed the fight? Uh, we see, you know, time tells all. That's the, that's the beautiful thing about the sport. <laughs> You can do all this and say all this, but when you get there, you can't lie. You can't lie to yourself. If it's more leg kicks, this guy talking about leg kicks, he over here fighting with, uh, fight out there fighting, training with Marky, Mikey Garcia or something, you know? And man, and Mikey Garcia coming on and calling me out, you know what I mean? It's like, what the hell is this guy talking about? I don't know, I guess uh, if you can't beat him, you try to fight him, so whatever. I mean, when you fought him the first time, like, could you tell, did you think going into that fight, he would throw more leg kicks? And when you came out, were you, was that like something that surprised you at all? Or did you not really notice yeah. in the fight? What was your... To be honest, I you know what? You guys watch all my fights. You guys see me fight all the time. And it is what it is. You know what he said? It is what it is. And uh, it's what he said. You know, I, I was expecting leg kicks, but I was expecting him to shoot too, you know? All these strikers, you guys always tell me, oh, this guy's going to strike with me. He's striking me. Name one striker that fully struck with me. Nobody. All these guys strike with me, and then they end up starting looking for that's takedowns. So I expected him. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> so that's why that's why we was there. That's why we're here. You know, I was getting ready for the best auto. This is the best auto. I feel great. I feel 120, 30 percent, 150 percent. There's a lot of things in this camp that we added that uh, that I can't wait to use. I can't wait to go out there and show you guys. When did this kind of uh, self awareness come around with it? it? Is what it is at the end of the day and stuff. Like you're having fun with it. You're turning uh, into like clothes and stuff. Yeah. When did that? Because you've always kind of spoke like that. Yeah. But when did you turn the corner? A I think bit? so. I turned the corner when someone pointed it out. A fan made a remix video. Drop. It said how to single out Max Holloway. Uh, it is what it is by Max Holloway. Go check it out. You guys saw my album cover. And uh, it's good. It's it's sick. I'm so happy. Are you walk out too? I d we I, I got something special for Detroit. Detroit, my walkout song is something special. Uh, it's gonna be amazing. I got something for Detroit. Perfect. I feel like there's a absolute changing of the guard when you beat him the first time, but 
if there wasn't officially then, does it feel like there is now based on the response you get from these guys? Oh yeah, for sure. You know, um, he like I say, he's the greatest of all time in our weight class. You know, he did a lot of great things, and people get telling me, "What you're gonna do this and that when you take home and blah blah blah." I'm like, you know, I'm beating him for a second time. I, I still got a bunch of things to catch up with him. You know, he he has a bunch of records, and I and I and those records are meant to be broken. You know, and I'm here. He had his yes, yes, exactly. He had his time. There's levels to this. He had his era. It's a blessed era, like they said. This, uh, the big record that no one talks about as much, people talk about Demetrius shots and title defense and everything, but it's Anderson Silva's 16 consecutive wins. Uh -huh. You're getting pretty close to that. Uh -huh. you, is that something you have your sights on as well? Uh, you know, I want to know every time. I'm focused on being one. I'm 0-0 right now. I'm looking for being 1-0. And, and, you know, too much people start looking too forward. You know, they start being sl getting sloppy. They start training less uh, training less, and being lazy. And I ain't that guy. You know, I, I, I want to be here for a long time. Like I said, my birthday is uh, on Monday, so uh, I, I want to be here for a long time. I want to fight in front of you guys. Hell yeah! 26 is the new 19, I heard. So it is what it is. It's fun, and uh, that's what I want to do. I want to focus on present things right now, and present right now is beating Aldo. Then we can start talking about records and stuff. All right, thanks, guys. Thanks, man. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Thank you guys. Thank you guys.